In this tutorial, I will show you how to install controller with a Raspberry Pi board and then registering it in Minitor. This is how a Raspberry Pi board looks like, you can buy a Raspberry Pi 3 or 4 board. For Raspberry Pi 4 the 1GB version is enough for our controller since the 2GB and 4GB versions also available. Before starting, let's check the needed parts. In addition to the Raspberry Pi board, you need a power supply with a USB cable an Ethernet cable, a micro SD card and RAM reader for writing controller image to SD card. Start by inserting SD card to RAM reader and connect it to your computer. In the next step you will need to use an image writing tool to install the image you have downloaded on your SD card. Belina Etcher is a graphical SD card writing tool that works on Mac OS, Linux, and Windows, and is the easiest option for most users. You can find the download link in description. Also, you need to download the latest Minitor controller image from the website. Once everything is ready, open Belina Etcher then select the image you downloaded from the Minitor's website. Then select the SD card you wish to write your image to. And click on the Flash button. Once it is finished take out the micro SD card and then insert it on the Raspberry Pi slot. Now plug the Raspberry Pi Ethernet to your router so it gets a random IP from your router's DHCP and also don't forget to plug and connect the adapter. On your computer find the Raspberry Pi IP address with an IP scanner. I will put a free IP scanner tool link in the description. Then open the IP address of Raspberry Pi on your browser. If everything is correct you will see the controller serial number you will need it on farm setup step in Minitor's website. Now you can move your Raspberry board to your farm and connect it to same switch with miners and set up your farm from miners dashboard.